Hello guys, I hope everybody is fine. Uh, in today's lecture, we will be discussing about the acceptability of the string. The acceptability of a string is uh, entirely dependent on the final state. It means any string that we are processing, if that string is processed till the final state, that means that state uh, that a particular string is accepted, else it's not. So how we are basically constructing uh, the, how we are basically finding out the acceptability of the string. So there's a question which is given over here, uh, where uh, the question says that consider a finite state machine whose transition function is given. And uh, we have set of states, uh, the tuples given with uh, Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4, uh, Q3 uh, states are given, as well as uh, input symbols 0 and 1 are given and set of accepting states which are uh, which is Q0 and incidentally it is an, an initial state 2. So in this table uh, we have Q0 which is uh, initial state and it is also represented as an accepting state also. Right now how we are basically going to check the string which is given to us is 1 1 triple zero one. So how we are basically going to check that? Very, very simple. Uh, we have to see with Q0 uh, when it is given 0. So always you have to start from initial state. Your initial state is Q0 and the string which is given to you is 11001. Right? So Q0 when 1 is given to it, Q0 when 1 is given to it, it actually goes to Q1. So it means you are writing Q1 over here with 1 triple zero 1 again pending. Then again you check with Q1 when 1 is given to Q1. So Q1 when 1 is given to it, it goes to Q0. So it means you will write Q0 over here and you will are left with triple zero 1. Uh, then Q0 when it is given 0, Q0 when it is given 0, it goes to Q2. So uh, I will write Q2 and double zero 01 is pending. Q2 when 0 is given, just check Q2 when 0 is given, it goes to Q0. So you will write Q0, 0 and 1, right? So we have got Q0 when uh, 0 and 1 is given to it. We just have to check what kind of answer it will give. Q0 when 0 is given, uh, it goes to Q2. So it means I will write Q2 and only 1 is left and if you can check Q2 when 1 is given to it, Q2 when 1 is given to it, it goes to Q3. Actually it goes to Q3. So you have to check, you will get, just check over here, I am putting the answer over here, Q3. Now all you need to find out is that whether this Q3 is a final state or not, Unfortunately, in this question, only Q0 was an accepting state. That was the final state. In incidentally, that was your initial state. So over here, we have got the answer Q3. Had it been Q0, we would have clearly said that 11001 is accepted by this, uh, by this particular transition table. And it means it is an accepted string. Unfortunately, we are getting Q3. It means 11001 is unfortunately not accepted by this automata. Hopefully this is clear to you. Uh, so in the next lecture, you will see the acceptability of the st uh, states uh, from NFA and DFA. Thank you very, very much.